We're a European wholesaler, so we're based, uh, headquarters based out of Hamburg in Germany. Um, about 3,000 employees, mainly wholesale towards the printing and um, fiscal industry. The first challenge is definitely in the market, say, meaning that okay, the printing industry is certainly a market that's not growing. On the contrary, it's, it's, it's becoming smaller, so we're very rapidly diversifying both in products and in services. So we, uh, we, have a, we are now focusing, for example, on healthcare with cleaning products. We are focusing on packaging, but also IT. And that's sort of the last leg we've now been working on. We are providing them a number of IT services to our customers. And more and more we see them coming to us and saying, oh, we want a good way from, of ordering from you. And we have a few problems that uh, along the line we'd like you to fix. And that's where Betty Blocks uh, comes in as a sort of front end to, to our customer. They log into what they believe to be their own little web shop, uh, which in, in essence is, is Betty Blocks, where we can start to play around with whatever it is they, they want. They want the picture to be large, small, they want two pictures, they want an approval flow, they want access to the technical documents. All that can be very quickly altered in the system, so they really get the feeling it's their software. And we said, okay, let's build a technical, uh, a technical MVP proof to us that for us, Betty Blocks and our backend sales software, yeah, can integrate the way we would expect it to do. Uh, Azuri helps um, companies with their digital um, opportunities, uh, whatever problems they are facing, and we're using no-code platforms for that, such as the Betty Blocks platform. So uh, one of the main challenges was integrating with their existing systems. So they are using now the, the SANA web shop, which is uh, integrated with uh, Microsoft Dynamics. And we need to make a web shop which could talk to their web shop and their backend systems. But we also need to make a collection of products for every single user. The user, for example, can or can't see the price. Uh, it depends on its role in the application. Uh, we're looking at multi-language working with units, uh, units of measure. These are like minor things you should think, but they're all like causing a lot of complexity in applications and also in integrations with current systems of them. It's been unthinkable that a customer asked mid-December, can we have our personalized web shop and then uh, end of February we're already processing say 10 orders a day. We expect to be around uh, 50 orders a day by, uh, by April. And then we'll make a multi-tenant, meaning that we'll start to roll it out towards other customers and then it will easily go up to, up, up to 100 and more. The biggest eye-opener in the whole um, Betty Blocks project has been uh, how much you can realize in such a short time. Uh, everything used to take long, you had functional specifications, budget, technical specifications. Yeah, all these tips you don't need anymore. You build something and as you are building it, you, yeah, yeah, you work in loops. You say, okay, let's change this, let's change that whilst you're sitting together at the table. And that makes the, uh, the, the, the throughput time and the cost reduces it tremendously. That way of working uh, for us has opened certainly the eyes of our managing directors as well. Saying, wow, 